so guys in this video I'm going to show you guys how to achieve the flawless looking brow easy step you can do your eyeballs in less than six minutes so I'm not going to talk too much let's just jump right into it but before we get into the video I want to just share with you guys what I use in this video and what you actually need in order to achieve the flawless looking brow that you want to have so the first thing that you definitely do need is an eyebrow pencil you can choose to use a pomade you can choose to use a powder but in this video I use an eyebrow pencil and the, and the eyebrow pencil that I decided to use this is the one by benefits this is the precisely my brow eyebrow pencil and this is what I use I use um, the pens the shade 5 so this is the number 5 pencil and then you also need two brushes you need an angle brush just like this you can choose to use um, a straight brush it's up to you but you need something that has a very thin edge like that brushes like the end is very it's almost like very very sharp that's the kind of end you need and then the second um, brush that you need you just need an, an extra brush just to clean their brows to look as neat as much as possible or just to, you know even out the concealer that you're going to use then the last thing that you need, you need a concealer. A concealer is just used to clean the eyebrow just to make it look as nice as much as possible and to make it as flawless as possible. That's what we're going for. So without talking too much, let's jump right into this video and see how we got this brows looking all good. Come it up just so that you see the hairs. I don't really have so much hair so you can see very few. So you just come it out just to see exactly where you're supposed to start. So I just take my eyebrow pencil and I start right at the beginning of my brows or where I want it to, to start like right at the beginning. So I just follow that line from underneath and I draw it. It's preferable to do like strokes just so that you know you can easily control that than to just draw a line. So normally I don't go right all the way from the beginning like how I did the bottom lash. I go like um, like right here, like the midpoint, not the midpoint, like almost to the quarter of my eyebrow. And um, one thing I want to really advise us not to do is to have it very harsh. So that's why I start like the quarter into my brows. I don't start it all the way up here just so that I don't have too much product right at the beginning. We don't need those boxes people. Then I draw another line and I take the ash right now and I connect it so all you need to do now after you have those two lines you want to just fill your eyebrows you know draw the pencil inside whatever you want to use you just fill the in you fill the inner part of it wherever there's no hair just you just just pull it out and you just comb it up you know just to even out everything now just to clean up I just take a little bit of the concealer I put it at the back of my hand then I use now my brush, I take a little piece, like I do that on both sides. I start to clean from the inner aspect of my eye and I just clean up, you know, you just basically, you're just taking those shots, short strokes as much as possible to clean up. You don't just want to go all zoom because you can easily mess it up. Once you take those short strokes, you, you, I mean, in less than no time, you realize that you have a perfect bar. So take those short strokes and you just clean up, clean up, clean up. Once you have that nice and done, that's where the second brush now comes in, where you're just going to use that to just clean up, just so that you know you have everything nice and even. Now, in many videos out there, people will tell you to use um, two to three shades lighter concealer for your bottom lash, for your bottom eyebrow, and uh, uh, your skin tone or your, your normal shade. 
at the top I prefer to use a concealer that is more like my skin tone because once you use a shade 2 to 3 lighter than you you have to do a lot of work in order to blend I, I don't want that yes it has a good highlighting effect you can always highlight your um, your brow bone with a powder or whatever you want to highlight, highlight your brow bone with so I prefer to use something that is more like my skin tone just so that when I clean it it looks all nice and you know nice and even like if you see my eyebrows like I don't really have a lot to do when I have to put on foundation or, or anything I don't have to go back to try to clean up you know so that's basically it you know so once you do that once you clean it up you go up also at the top you start from the beginning and you just apply your concealer you clean it up you use the next brush and you just clean up everything and bam you have a perfect fabulous looking snatched eyebrow thank you so much for watching this video i hope you did learn something leave a comment for me in the comment section below and thank you very so much for watching this video until then stay blessed and remember you are the best and you are the original bye Oh, 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 oh,